Welcome back, Lion family, where love is our nature. Today, we're bringing you in on 24 hours with our newborn baby. We're pretty much getting down the routine of taking care of our son, but we're still learning here and there new things. He's so cute, he's sleeping right now. We just got ready for the day. We took him out of his crib, but we really gotta wake him up so that he can eat. Hey, son. Kayo. He looks so peaceful. <laughs> yeah, it kind of sucks that we have to wake him up, but it's for him to grow big and strong. It's true. By the way, we just want to say shout out to all you lions who have been following us since day one, yeah. being part of the journey. Today's post notification shout out goes to Miriam. Thank you for having our post notifications on. If you want a post notification shout out, make sure you comment down lions and turn your post notifications when you're done. All right, baby, go ahead. Wake him up. Uh oh, the little lion's waking up. Wake up, wake up, poopy. I love when he stretches in the morning. Wake up, wake up, poopy. So, mommy's gonna feed him first today. We actually take turns. Tonight, I volunteered to take the late night shift, so I'll be waking Thank up in you. the middle of the night. But then, Brenda is gonna have tomorrow. Sometimes we wake up together in the middle of the night or we'll just switch off like she'll do 1 a.m. I'll do 3 a.m. and then yeah. we switch off. But tonight I'm gonna take the night. So let's feed him for the first meal, baby. Go ahead. Oh. All right, this is my favorite part. We gotta take out this pacifier. That's so sad. Ready? One, two, three. Oh. <laughs> oh, he's hungry. All right, babe. Get to the feeding chair. Let's do this. Let's do it. Thanks, baby. So Brenda is pumping her breasts for milk. She's also breastfeeding. And then we also have formula as well for those times that um, we don't have the other milk ready. Do you want my this is how you know baby's hungry, guys, when they're moving their mouth this way. Yeah. Do you want mommy boobs? That way you want. Ready? And that right there. Is a happy baby. That's a happy baby. <laughs> Romeo! Romeo has already been fed. Always give attention to all your kids, guys. Everyone deserves love. Especially if you bring a newborn back. You definitely have to give attention to the animals because they get a lot of anxiety and jealousy sometimes. Yeah, that's true. They notice those things, guys. I mean, I remember when Lucas and Marcus were born, they're six years younger than me. Me and Dara were both a little jealous. We were like, yo, our parents love Lucas and Marcus more, but the thing is they're just really busy because they have to grow a newborn up. So we don't understand that when we're that age. I would say the majority of the day, what we do is feed the baby and change the baby. Yeah, it's true. And what else after that is, you know, just holding the baby, giving him attention, yeah. putting him to sleep, Burp. burping him, always burp a baby after you feed them, very important guys. And sometimes we go out, but today is a pretty chill day that we're gonna spend the 24 hours inside. We are first time parents guys, so hopefully you can learn a thing or two from our experience and all those parents to be out there. It's such a blessing. Be excited. So Brenda did already pump today before we got ready. We've been using this right here, hospital grade pump. Medela, definitely recommend. And uh, it's a really powerful one. So yeah, you can rent it. We're renting it right now. Yeah, and what it does is really good because it mimic the baby sucking. So you don't feel as much pain and it does a really good job getting all the milk out compared to the other pumps out there. Time to burp the baby. We learned that it's good to tap on different parts of the back because the bubble travels. Good That's a good boy. one. You got one more in you? There you go. He's ready to sleep. Baby's getting changed. <laughs> we got some panda diapers here, fresh. <laughs> and guys, we recommend if you have a changing spot, Put some of these pads down, they're yeah. dog pads, to absorb anything that happens, especially with a boy. Sometimes he randomly pees and it shoots at us, or it'll go down this way, so, so it'll absorb that. Uh oh, baby's peeing. Oh no! 
Baby Spin. <laughs> Mommy almost got shot, right? Yeah, look at my hat. All right, baby's done. Now I want to keep the baby comfortable so he falls asleep easily. A little bit of tummy time and a little bit of skin to skin here. Sometimes we do, you know, the skin to skin without his clothes on, but I want to keep him warm. I'm so proud of him. And I got my favorite book over here that I usually read to him to help him fall asleep. Why a son needs a dad. So cute. And just relax. From the moment that I saw your beautiful face, held you close to my heart in a father's embrace. I promise to help you grow with strength and grace. My dear one, my sweet son, my boy. I love this book. Kids books are so simple, but very meaningful. Yeah. And a lot of the stuff that I read in here just reminds me of who we are. Love is our nature, the Lion yeah. family. And one of the things on the Lion Family Code, we live by the word of God, not by the world. So we don't try to get accepted by the standards of people, but the standards of God. To yeah. be the most best version of ourselves we can be and just spread as much good and positivity that we can in the world, right babe? Yeah. And that's what we're gonna teach our son. And he usually falls asleep with this last one, fully asleep. From the boy that you are to the man you will be, I love who you are and the promise I see. You make me the father I dreamed I could be, my dear son, my sweet son, my joy. Aww. And obviously there's also a book with mom as well. Yeah. Why mothers are important for their kids and their sons and everything. So um, one day we'll reveal that one in yeah. another vlog. But Daddy reads this to baby and mommy reads the mommy one to baby. So daddy's taking a nap right now. So for his late night that he had to stay up. Um, that was me yesterday and today will be him and I will wake him up when the food is ready that my grandma is doing Baby's sleeping too <laughs> He's so cute and I'm gonna go and tidy up baby's room right now I'm here in the baby's room and I am folding some clothes of his because we just done a lot of laundry and then uh, we're gonna give baby a bath and honestly guys, what we notice is giving a baby a bath really helps them. It helps them to relax and to have a better night's sleep. Baby. Mm. Wake up, food's ready. Mm. Let's go. Where's the baby? He's there with my grandma. You okay? Yeah, he's good. Come on. Okay. The baby's still sleeping? Yeah. His nap is longer than mine, right? Oh, yeah. That was well needed. Oh, wow. The table looks so nice. Let's see what grandma made. Oh, what did you make? Look over there. Fish. Whoa. Oh my so salmon guys. It's prawns. Okay. Aubergine. Aubergine over there as well. Oh my god, oh my god. That looks so good. Wow. Oh. Okra. Yeah. What's Bean that? soup. Bean soup. Whoa. A lot. That looks amazing. Thank you so much. Bob. Welcome. Welcome, my dad. Oh yeah, now I'm awake. The food yeah. looks good. Thank you, obrigado. The baby just woke up as well. So now grandma's gonna feed him. The baby's gotta eat first. Before mommy and daddy and Ross eat. Daddy's about to feed another son. Go, son, go. Go, Good boy. This is definitely where we're gonna have our future line family family meetings. Yeah. We're gonna start eating right now. We don't wanna annoy you with our chewing. So we'll see you guys at the bath. Enjoy. See you. Bye. Get back for, for those of you that know, we are in the baby's bathroom right now. So we are connected to his bedroom right here. Stay tuned, the next video will be Baby Kyle's official room tour. The room is very personal to us, so you gotta be sure to tune into that one.
All right, he's about to get into the bath. All right, so now we're about to give Kyle his bath. This is one of the last steps before we go to bed. We're going to give him another blue outfit, a clean one, like the one he's wearing now. He really loves those, they're really comfy. So we're gonna replace his current blue one with this new clean one. And let's get started. He loves this, it relaxes him, so. Yeah, and his uh, blue outfit is like his pajamas, you know? Exactly. <laughs> Alright, Kyle, let's get started. The spa has begun. Five star baby spa. Yay. Kyle loves his bath. And mommy does a very good job. Some nice, scented baby shampoo. Oh, yeah. Clean those toes. Clean those toes. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, clean that fresh hair. Baby's almost done. My favorite part. Baby's washed. Look at our cute little creature. He's so cute. All bundled up. All right, we're gonna go dry him now. And change him. The baby's getting his last feed right now before he goes to sleep. Remember, don't let a baby's cry stress you out. Instead, stay focused. Know what it means, what the baby's trying to communicate to you. Okay, baby has been changed. Yeah. Baby has been fed. And he's ready to go to bed now. <laughs> go to sleep. We're moving into the late hours now, guys. <laughs> Good night. Sweet dreams, little lion. I'll see you in a few hours. My late night shift. Caillou. Caillou. You're a good boy, Caillou. Caillou. I love you, Caillou. Caillou. Always gotta burp the baby. It's okay, baby. Good boy. Good boy. Sometimes when the baby's not burping, it's good to move him around a little bit in a circle, very gently, back and forth. Always hold the neck and give him some time. Lion code, always look out and making sure that your family's never hungry, never cold, never scared. It's very important on looking out. Got the late night diaper change, make sure the baby's comfy. He didn't do any poopy or pee in his diaper. Baby cream for the diaper rash. Almost done. Good boy. Good 
Boy, I'm so proud of you. Look at that smile. I think you're ready for bed, right? All right, let's go. Good night, son. I'll see you at the next shift. Three hours. This is how tired mommy was. Baby's asleep again. Woke up a few times. Still the middle of the night, but now daddy's hungry. I'm not saying this is healthy, but I'm gonna reward myself with a nice late night snack before I hit the sack. It's gonna give me the energy the next time I wake up. This is what people talk about when they say, are you getting enough sleep? Are you getting any sleep? I'm still getting sleep, but it's broken up. But it's all worth it because I love my little lion. I'll do anything for my family. So other dads out there, moms, stay strong. It's all worth it in the end. Thank you all for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe. And remember, we are the Lion family. Love is our nature. As it says in the Holy Bible, in Proverbs 28-1, the wicked flee when no one is pursuing, but the righteous are bold as a lion. Which means those with bad intentions run away from their fears. But those that are righteous and live with love in their heart and good energy, they're courageous like a lion. And good things come to them because they fight for good. And that's who we are, lions. Warriors of God. Go for it. Don't be scared. Do the right thing. And remember always, be there for your family for all eternity like a lion. I love you guys so much. We'll see you next time. Peace.